Susan was one of the first homeowners I met when I came to Gerritsen Beach. Though it had been six months since the hurricane, she was still in the process of rebuilding her home. When I walked in, right, the, the couch had floated. Mm -hmm. So you had to like come in like this and like squeeze, squeeze through. Squeeze by the couch. Everything just floated. To one side or? It just, just all, all over, over, all over. The doors were sticking, you see all the, I was kicking the door oh, right yeah. to get in, that everything swelled. From it swollen. You could see the water line behind the door. Right here? Oh, God. It was just devastation. You just looked at the house and you said, all right, it's gone. My name is Melanie. I'm Maria. Three months ago, Maria and I both decided to volunteer our time helping communities recover from Hurricane Sandy. Follow us over the next few months as we get to know the people, the organizations, and stories behind Rebuilding After Sandy. Let's get to work. Let's go. There's been some work, but like, did you guys have any help with insurance or just uh, doing it yourself? Or? Basically doing it, you know, myself, uh, some insurance money. Uh huh. But it's certainly not enough to, for anybody to repair and then replace everything. I had filled an application out in January, and then I got a call from Rebuilding Together, and they came here, they looked at the house, they assessed it, and the next day they said, you've been approved. They're willing to help and uh, get the home back to a home. The day before the rebuild, I ran into Susan and she shared with me some really exciting news. Not only was her home being rebuilt, she found out that Meredith Corporation and Crate and Barrel were providing all her new home furnishings. An interior designer came here and working with Crate and Barrel, she said, let me get what you would like, what your personality is and see what we, how we can match that up. So we picked out curtains and uh, furnishings and little touches. So and Crate and Barrel is, is donating all your home furnishings? Yeah. Having gotten to know Susan, I was excited when I finally got a chance to get my hands dirty and work alongside Crate and Barrel volunteers as we put the finishing touches on our house. The next day after the paint had dried, the team from Better Homes and Gardens and Crate and Barrel got to work making Susan's house a home again. Remembering touring Susan's storm damaged home months before, I was so glad to be able to sit with her in her finished living room and hear about her experience. I mean, you look back and you say, I, you never think that you're going to see this day ever, ever. And it was a long haul, a long haul, but finally, finally, you can come back home. Thank you isn't enough, and I just, I don't have the words to describe. It's amazing what you guys have done. I'm so, 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 so grateful. I can't even describe it. I, I couldn't have done it without everybody. Throughout our time with Rebuilding Together, it was okay to be a learning volunteer. And after so many months, we started to get the hang of things. 